torch. We about to burn on the thrones. We need a change. Look at the world that we live. Look how the evil is grown. All the innocence lost. We need a new beginning. Man, the vision is off. We need to rage, rage war. Yeah, we need to rage on. I'm here. War boots, I'm gonna buy a pair. No suits, just fighters here. Grassroots since the right gear. I'm still fly like a pilot. Yeah, I'm fly. Brave hearts never die in fear. I ain't a stranger to the danger. I'm a living, I'm dying here. What's up YouTube? Welcome back. My name is Prodigy. Today I'm playing some Fortnite. Um, I know this video is really, really late. I haven't been posting very much because I've been really busy. Um, I just wanted to jump into some Chapter 2 Fortnite and tell you guys what I think of it. The good things, the bad things, and whatever. So let's just jump right into it. First thing is the sniping. The sniping is so on point. Oh my gosh, I love it. I don't know what they did, if they updated it, if they didn't update it, if I'm just imagining things. It just feels like my sniping is on point this chapter. The previous chapter of Fortnite, I could not hit any snipes at all. I was horrible at sniping. I haven't even been really playing at all. So I don't know if it's just because I learned something. I don't know what it is. But let me know down in the comments if you think that they've changed something with sniping. Because I definitely do. And some of my friends also do. Just so on point but the second thing I really like about the new chapter is the balancing the weapons you don't find purple gold weapons near or even blue weapons as much as you used to um, now you have to get uh, materials and upgrade them at workbenches your, your weapons to make them into the purple or the gold you know so um, I've played quite a few games and I've only gotten one scar out of a care package. I haven't got, I haven't found it in any of the loot boxes or anything. So, uh, they may have lessened the amount that you get the scar or whatnot. But I just feel like the less overpowered guns have made the game more balanced. Also, another thing that could be a pro or a con to you, depending on if you're new or if you're a more veteran player, is the bots. The bots in my mind are a good thing I mean because I suck at Fortnite I'm not nearly as good as a lot of people but I try but the bots just make it uh, a lot more better in my opinion for two reasons one it gives you loot helps you just get into the game get looted up get ready two is because it gives you confidence you see these really crappy bots and you go after them and you know they're a bot because how bad they're sucking they're not even building it just gives you confidence to go after other players like actual players it's, that's just my opinion from what I've heard the bots are like an AI system they're gonna learn from players they're gonna get better as time goes by so if that's the truth then I'll be able to grow with the bots I'll get better as a player, you know, and if you're not very good at Fortnite, then you'll just get better too. It's a really good time to play Fortnite right now because you're not always getting pushed by veteran players that are just going to build battle you to the skyline and kill you. But, like right here, the bots, they're just standing there. Like, this guy, this is a bot right here. Like, if this was not a bot, they'd have a bunch of builds around them. I mean, it just gives you a little bit of chance to work on your aim, to get better at the game. So if you're new at Fortnite, now is the time to play. Because you will get better at Fortnite, you'll be challenged by decent players here and there. But, right now, the bots suck. This is a really good time to play Fortnite, to get better, to get better at your aim, to get better at building. Because you're not going to constantly be faced with those veteran players that you are originally. Um... So as I was saying, this whole bot situation could be a con also. It just depends on the person you are. Some people I've heard from say that it's going to make the game to where it's not a challenge anymore. makes it too easy for people to win. But what I think Epic is trying to do is they're trying to just make it to where they can draw in more new players. Because it makes it easier to learn the game if you're not constantly getting your butt whooped. But that's just me. That's my opinion. But... One other thing I wanted to discuss was 
the pump shotgun. The pump shotgun, I just feel like they've made it really bad. Um, it just does not do enough damage. I've hit people in the head, got 74 damage. I get tack shotgun to death faster than I can even shoot another bullet. It's just not very balanced. They need to put it back to how it was. Um, just tell me what you guys think about that. But that's pretty much all I have for you guys. I'm really enjoying the new chapter. This is honestly the most fun I've had on Fortnite ever so they did a good job for the most part a few things that they could balance and change and make the game even more better but that's just my opinion I wanted to make this video for you guys but if you like my videos and support me hit that like and subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos and I'll see you guys in the next one see ya